Las Vegas. This is NAB Show Live, produced by Broadcast Beat. Hey guys, Larry Becker on the trade show floor in the Central Hall today at NAB Show Live. And I'm at the TV Logic booth and I'm with Wes Donahue. Now, you guys have some amazing stuff. Wes, first of all, hi. How are you? Doing great. Thank you so much for taking the time. I know you guys are busy. You got a, a, an official press conference coming up very shortly, and you have some amazing things going on with the 4K workflow. Great. Tell me what you guys are doing. Well, um, really, you know, 4K has, has sort of started to mature a bit. Sure. Um, we're seeing 4K workflows, 4K cameras, 4K switchers. You know, every, everything is really starting to, to gel, you know, within the broadcast industry with 4K and of course it's still advancing and so what we're trying to do in the monitoring side of things is really make 4K more accessible to many of our customers. Um, we have uh, I think now five different models that are 4K or 4K ready. What I mean by 4K ready is we have a 17 inch model that um, it, it allows you to bring in uh, 4K resolution in, in 3G quad. Uh, 6G single or 12G single and then display it on a 1920 by 1080 resolution monitor and then use that monitor to go into one-to-one -one mode to zoom in to what is actually the, the full 4K resolution. And that's for on set um, and some production you know, monitoring. Then we take a step up from there to a new model called the LUM240G, which we're really excited about because that one is an actual native 3840 by 2160 panel wow. with this 3G quad, 6G single, 12G, you know, single input, and it uh, supports uh, two sample interleave, you know, division. So what we're really trying to do is give people a monitor that that has just about everything on it that you could need. Yeah, incredible from, flexibility. Right, from HD all the way up through 4K, including um, in that 24-inch model, uh, built-in 3D lookup tables and the ability to import and export LUTs. So, you know, you can use that monitor for color critical on set work, as well as um, being able to uh, use it in post-production as, you know, when you're, you're in the editorial process. So, you know, from broadcast to post-production, everything, um, it's a really versatile, you know, 24-inch monitor, and we're listing it for well under, you know, $10,000, it's actually under $9,000, uh, which is a pretty good entry point for yeah. 4K monitor with, you know, 6, 12G, all that stuff on it. So yeah. we're really excited about that one. Um, the, the other two models we're showing that are slightly larger than that is a 42-inch and a 55-inch. Those are more like client monitors, if you, if you will. They're also uh, broadcast um, monitors to be used in the studio to monitor feeds or multi-viewer feeds in 4K. So they also have the 12G input, just one, and then uh, the, the, the 3G input all the way across, and then they do conversion. So if you come in 3G HD, you can actually up convert to 4K and come out 12G from that original 3G HD. Series. You're solving a lot of problems. Yeah, well, that's what, that's what we're trying to do. <laughs> so uh, those, those are the main uh, new things we have. We have a couple of, on the smaller production side of things, um, we have a couple monitors that actually are already shipping um, in our 7-inch series. Um, we previously had only two models uh, that, that had a 1024 by 600 resolution. So what we've done now is we've got a, a, a extra, you know, uh, what we call a high bright or daylight monitor that's 1500 nit. That one's actually been out for a while. That's called the um, SRM uh, one. 074, got to get all the numbers right okay. here, SRM 074W. Then we introduced two new models, one that's uh, essentially the same form factor. They're all they're all on the same chassis, which is a magnesium alloy, very, very tough, uh, durable um, case. Um, the, the lower cost one is called the LVM 070C, and what we did with that is we wanted to make these seven inch monitors more accessible to people that are working with HDSLRs, independent people that didn't don't have the budget to spend you know, on, on the very high end. So we brought that one down drastically in price, but kept as many of the features in there as we possibly sure. could. We you know, took one input out, um, you know, we took a few buttons off the front, that kind of stuff, but other than that, it's pretty much the same monitor. So what we, then the, the third addition to that is the uh, LVM075A. That's a full 1920 by 1080 version of, of the same series with everything in it, including, okay. uh, and all of these, by the way, have a feature that, that lets you take the log feed from cameras and convert that to linear, which means you can 
if you've got a log feed coming out of the camera and you want to see what it looks like in 709 while you're monitoring, that's built into the monitor. That's you just great. select which log you're coming in with, and there you go. So those are the main things we have you know, new here at the show, and sure. we're pretty excited about So it. guys, if you're at the show, you got to come by Central Hall. We're at booth 3623, and if they're not here at the show, they can find out about it on the web where? Right, on www.tvlogicusa.com. TVLogicUSA.com. Check it out. Guys, we've got more show floor reporting, but you got to come by here if you want to see these high res 4K monitor solutions. For NAB Show Live, I'm Larry Becker.